welcome to the another session of concise mathematics class 10 and in today's session we are going to solve a question from uh, chapter number 2 banking and uh, exercise is uh, 2b and question number 3 so here you see exercise is 2b and question number is 3 so here question is saying the maturity value of a RD account is 16176 okay that means there is an account in a bank called as an RD RD is what recurring deposit account right so once that account or once that uh, amount got matured the value of that amount is 16176 right now I mean as you know that uh, in recurring deposit we need to pay every month so it's saying the monthly installment is rupees 400 that means a person need to pay 400 every month and the bank is going to give the interest rate of 8% right so it's saying that and the rate of interest is 8% means whatever the amount you are going to submit for certain time on that amount bank will be giving the interest rate of 8% now the question is asking find the time that is period of that RD account means the person has to submit or give the installment of 400 rupees up to what time right what will be the period one month two month eight month two year five years or whatever so that duration that time period we need to identify in this question right so hope you understood understood the question if not let me know in this comment section i will explain it once again all right so there's the question now whenever you find these kind of uh, questions there are two formulas which you need to use and the formula is already given in this chapter if you see here is written mv mv is what maturity value is equal to p into n plus i p is the value the money what you are going to pay or what you are paying per month right like in our case is 400 and is number of month which we don't know that we need to find it out and i is interest on it means the value means eight percent value of that uh, money means see you you have submitted let's say two month 400 rupees that is 800 but at the rate of 8 percent what will be the value what will be the money we are going to receive that is 800 plus how much value right it's not 8 percent is the value of the 8 percent that is uh, i here right so let me write this formula first So this is a chapter 2 exercise 2 B All right so and, and the question number is 3 right so let me write the formula first what are the what are the formula we are going to use here one is maturity value is equal to p into n plus i right now second formula what we are going to use is is already given in the book which is i is equal to p into n n plus 1 by 2 into 12 into r by 100 so p and we already know r is the rate of interest which is 8 in our case right so let me write that as well so here it is i is equal to p into n n plus 1 oblique 2 into 12 into r by 100 right so we are going to use these two formula in this kind of a question so let's get it started so let's solve the question let me write few things which is given in the question so the first thing in this question is given as a 
मेच्योरिटी वैल्यू राइट लेट मी चेंज द स्केच पेन या सो मेच्योरिटी वैल्यू इज वॉट वन सिक्स वन सेवन सिक्स राइट दैट्स वन सेकेंड थिंग इज गिवेन एज रेट रेट इज वॉट रेट ऑफ इंटरेस्ट विच इज अगेन गिवेन एज एन एट परसेंट देन पी पी इज वॉट द अमाउंट विच इज पेइंग पर मंथ विच इज फोर हंड्रेड रुपीज एंड we don't know the period for how many month or or the duration the person has to give this amount so let's say period is equal to n n is what n is number of month clear we don't know what is n here now let's start putting this value in this formula first so maturity value is what let me write formula quickly here mv is equal to p into n plus i right mv is what 16176 is equal to p is what 400 n plus i so so i is equal to 16176 minus 400 n right so this is equation number 1 now if i see the second equation which is this 2 into 12 into r by 100 so let's start putting the value so p is what p is 400 into n we don't know n plus 1 oblique 2 into 12 into r is what r is 8 oblique 100 right 0 0 cancel 0 0 cancel 2 1 0 2 2 2 0 4 2 1 0 2 2 6 0 12 2 3 0 6 2 4 0 8 so if we solve this that will become 4 n n plus 1 oblique what 3 and that is what that is i so this is my equation number 2 now if i see equation number 1 and 2 we can say that One six one seven six minus four hundred n is equal to what? Four n n plus one oblique three. Let's multiply three to here. So one six one seven six into three that will become four eight five two eight minus twelve hundred n is equal to four n n plus one. right uh we can also write here like say similar this 4n square plus 4n next let's make it uh, all the things here so it will be like 4n square plus 4n plus 1200n minus 48528 is equal to 0 right i just move left hand side uh, these two numbers to right hand side okay so 4n square plus 4n and then when uh, when uh, i move minus 1200n to right side it will become plus 1200n minus this uh, 48528 goes to right and that will become minus 48528 is equal to 0 all right now uh If I see, I can add four n and twelve hundred n and here, so it will become four n square plus one two zero four n minus four eight five two eight is equal to zero, right? So let me write the same equation in next page. so here i am writing again the same equation which is 4 n square plus 1204 n minus 4528 okay 1204 n minus 48528 is equal to 0 now here if you can see i can divide this value by 4 so 
let divide the equation by 4 so this will become what this will become n square plus 301 n minus 1 2 1 3 2 is equal to 0 right now if I can see here now this is become a quadratic equation and if we solve this this will become n square plus 36 n plus 3 3 7 n minus 1 2 1 3 2 is equal to 0 and now if we can solve this further that will become n n minus 36 n minus 36 and here is plus 3 3 7 is equal to 0 so we have two value here 1 n minus 36 come on n minus 36 and another is n plus 3 3 7 is equal to 0 now if we see these two equation n minus 36 is equal to 0 then n is equal to 36 which is possible 36 month and if we solve this equation n plus 3 3 7 is equal to 0 then n is equal to minus 3 3 7 so month cannot be in negative so this is not going to be our answer so the answer is n which is 36 month means rd account opens or the value of uh, the time period rd account time period is 36 months all right so that's the answer hope you are able to understand this question if not or if there is any doubt or question please let me know i will uh, help you to solve this again probably in different way right let me know if there is any question bye bye and take care